Okay, so I got this this aloe. I don't know exactly what to do with it. All right, so I'm interested in consuming it. I'm afraid of uh, the griping that my intestines will experience. So I'd want to uh, have as little as possible. But this looks like something that I would be able to pick in uh, the city somewhere. I'd be able to find these in the wild. I just I wasn't too sure what they what they look like, but maybe I'll just cut off like an end since this is this is an end that's cut off. Maybe I'll just cut off a section similar to that. It cuts off very easily. The taste is very bitter. Indeed. Very, very bitter. But welcoming. Hmm. And I don't know if that can show up. It's pretty interesting. It's just this gelatinous mass. Can I bite into that? Okay, so I bit into the gelatinous mass. And... I don't know, I kind of like it. <laughs> just... <laughs> I really shouldn't be consuming too much of this. Because this is an unknown griping, it just makes your intestines gripe. Astringe, it's a strong astringent. Okay, maybe a couple of bites of this astringent. And go okay, with that. so it's been about, uh, it's been over 24 hours since I've last consumed. Well, not since I've last, since I last made a video of consuming this. And I've been consuming it periodically, uh, today, yesterday, and I don't feel any different. Alright, so, the most bitter part is the skin, the inner part of the skin. You can taste it very bitter. And then this, the, uh, this, the middle section, which is very, really, which just like... You can almost say it's like eating jello, but yeah, it's it's aloe, so it's very very uh, slimy, um, but it dries pretty quickly too. So my experience with this type of aloe is that it's it seems safe. It I was expecting my my uh, intestines to feel more like gri grippy, like they're gonna hurt because they're gonna gripe more. And that's, I believe that's happened with the aloe drinks, but the aloe drinks might be made of uh, an extract or something. The whole part is, is seems perfectly fine. 